All right, so today I'm gonna to be putting in the main bearings and the crankshaft of this engine. I'm gonna start with the upper bearings. I have a diesel laptop there with the torque specifications and the procedure for all of this stuff. So it's very important to not touch the surface of these bearings. They have what's called Babbitt on them. And it is very important to not get the oils of your skin on the surface of the bearings. But what I would like to show you is these are all marked. So these will all tell you if they are upper or lower bearings. And this one happens to be the thrust bearing. That is why it has part of this bearing on the side. That is to set the crankshaft end play. So that's important to do, have it done right. So here I'm going to show you how to install these bearings. I'm going to start with number seven and go to number one. Number six journal is the thrust bearing, which I will completely install later. These are very important to push the end opposite the tab in first and then push the end with the tab in and make sure they're seated with your fingers. Most of these are pretty easy to seat with just your fingers. For the thrust bearing, I was having a hard time getting it to seat with just my fingers, so I just decided to use the soft end, rubber end of a hammer and just push it in a little bit. And then I just checked the seating of the rest of the bearings. And now you're ready to install the crankshaft.